Hi Lunatics, um, right, this will be part three of basically Corrupt Gun Police, um, it's basically the list, you know, of the ones that have been caught um, so far, um, so let's zoom in a bit, I'm going to do this one page and then I'm going to do another video for the other one, because it gets a bit much reading it out, it makes you feel sick, um, right, March 2020, Sergeant Ross Coleman, Northamptonshire Police, indecent images of children. Uh, May 2020, Mark Sloan, PC Mark Sloan, Kent Police, dangerous driving. Um, one got, oh, let's just go back actually. Ross Coleman got a 12 month suspended sentence. Jesus. PC, uh, May still, PC, um, Dave Humperson, West, Mid West, Midlands, West Midlands Police, indecent image, sacked. Uh, June 2020, PC Derek Kennedy, Police Scotland, downloading child porn, awaiting sentence. Uh, PC Stephen Cloney, Merseyside Police, sold information to gangsters, jailed for five years. Ian Hales, Northumbria Police, sex with victim of crime, 18 months suspended. Uh, June 2020, WPC Rebecca Latham, Merseyside Police, charged with dangerous driving, proceeding. Um, June 2020, Sergeant Michael Grigg, Hertfordshire Police, sexual activity with a child, jailed for six and a half years. Uh, prison officer Chloe Jones in June 2020 uh, works for the prison service. Sex with prisoner, jailed for, eight, for 15 months. PC Claudia Peretti, Metropolitan Police. Police computer misuse, jailed for six months. Where did we get to? Oh, Jesus. Uh, June 2020 still. Um, Sergeant Peter Jordan, Merseyside Police, charged with ABH proceeding. PC Tim, this is July now, 2020. PC Tim Berema, Dorset Police, charged with murder of mistress, jailed to 10 years. July 2020 still. PC Jamie Holloway, West Mercia Police, death by dangerous driving, proceeding. Oh, we've got an Essex Police one. August 2020, PC Simon Jones, never come into contact with him, I don't think. Essex Police, gross misconduct. Oh, they're good at that. I resigned, who didn't commit a crime, as Paul Dacker says. Fucking thingy. Where are we at? Essex Police. Uh, Philip Barber, Cheshire Police, gross misconduct. Jailed for eight months. Um, August 2020. PC Tony Mowling, Essex Police, taking cocaine on duty, resigned. So, I don't know if, isn't that illegal? Shouldn't he have gone to court or something? I don't know. Maybe not. Must Maybe they've uh, just made it legal now, I don't know. PC Rudwell Walters, Metropolitan Police, charged with sexual assault, proceeding. WPC Gemma Dix. South Wales Police, her name rings a bell for some reason, I don't know why, might have been in the news. Sex acts while on duty. Final written warning. Wow. Whoever must have been her superior, she must have given a blowjob or something to get off with not getting sacked. Jesus Christ. Lauren Johnson, Merseyside Police, where are we at? August 2020. <sighs> Misconduct. 10 months suspended. Uh, August 2020, PC David Bunting, Greater Manchester Police Theft, jailed for three months. Sergeant Benjamin Nish, still August 2020, Met Police, Sexual Offences Proceeding. 
Uh, duh, 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 duh. PCSO David Mallard, August 2020 still. West Yorkshire Police inciting a child sexualised chat, jailed for 10 months. Fucking hell. August 2020 still. PC Darren Booth, West, York West Yorkshire Police, gross misconduct, sacked. PC Philip Ellis, Greater Manchester Police, gross misconduct, sacked. PC Paul Barron, Staffordshire Police, misconduct, resigned. Um, PC Lee Tatton, that rings a bell. This is September 2020 now. Staffordshire Police, child sex offences, jailed for six months. Oh dear, right. Uh, this list goes up to 2021. I think there's two more pages, so... <sighs> okay, bye.